Morning, Rick. Good morning. Yesterday you had mentioned that uh, uh, with respect to the Anaheim Ducks, you wanted to have a look at them. So would challenged but determined be a good way to describe Anaheim right now, or Listen, would you find a different way? Yeah, no, Minnesota's fighting for a playoff spot, and Anaheim gave them a, everything they could handle last night. It's a very determined group. It's a hard-working group. They've got enough skill to do some damage if you let them, so they're getting great goaltending. Um, so it's going to be a very tough game because there, there's no quit in that group, and you give them a lot of credit from where they are in the standings. But I know a couple of the guys on that team with Killer and Goody, and uh, they're, they're great competitors, and that's going to rub off on all the, everybody else in that room. Strategically, are they still pretty much doing yep. things the same way then even before the trading deadline? Yep. Yeah. So from your perspective then, uh, uh, because it has been such a difficult series for your club, you've gone to an O, but uh, are there certain things you're looking for tonight, Rick, that can maybe uh, it'll help uh, you control the game a little better? Well, we'd like to get off to a great start and, and put a couple of pucks in the net early. Um, so that would be that would be big help. The, again, with the, when you're playing a team that has nothing to lose, like they have, and the longer they hang into a game, uh, the more hope they have to win the game. So it would be nice for us to get off to a good start. But uh, listen, it doesn't matter. They're in the National Hockey League. They're all good players, and and they all have a lot of pride. So uh, the best thing for us, to answer your question, would be to try to get an early lead. Rick, has there been a determination that you hinted about whether Gabriel will go on the road trip with you? Gabe will not be. Um, uh, he will not be making the road trip. By further testing, he has an enlarged spleen. So at this point, there is no timetable. He just he, We have to take care of that, obviously, but he will not be traveling with the team. When did that flare up? Like Was that like, like the, in the Dallas game? Just the last couple of days. Uh, well, it's a little bit of everything built up to, to, yeah, to that assessment. Okay, thank you. And maybe you don't have the answer to this, but what's the treatment on that? Is that just something like you wait and it, hope it recovers on no, its own? No, they're, they're treating it as best they can. I don't have the medical answer for it. Yeah. No, I don't. But they, it is being treated as being looked at. He's would in good hands here. Yeah. Would there be concern? I mean, it's already been, I think this will be game eight tonight, but that this could go on for quite a while longer still? Like, you know, time will tell. Yeah. Um, your top line with Mark back in the lineup tonight. Can you let it? Uh, is it going to be? Is he going to be with Nick and Kyle again? Or? No, we're going to start Alex over there. They've had some success in the past, and I, I want to see what. Um, again, we're just getting uh, Tyler. I want to see what Nick looks with with those two, with Monahan and Tyler. Give it a lot of speed up there, and if that doesn't work, we move. It back. They've both been told if that doesn't work, we move Nick right back. To the right side. We have last home change here at home, so that helps. Sorry, just uh, one follow-up regarding Gabriel's uh, status, Rick. Uh, originally, it was a, an upper body injury. Yeah. Is, is, so, was that actually the spleen yeah. issue then? Per, was it what? The spleen issue? That was the No, not at that injury? point, no. So, there was All an upper body injury it, as yeah. well, but yeah. this is something separate. An additional, and, yeah. Okay. All right, thank you. How much do you feel for the guy? Yeah, I know. He's a great kid, and uh, he's overcome a few injuries over his, career, his early career, so you hope that when this is behind him, he gets a chance to get healthy and, and play consistently. So uh, we certainly miss him. Uh, he was a big part of the trade last year, and we saw the importance of him on our power play and on that top line when he was able to give, be given a few games to get his game going. So, yeah, you feel for him. Yeah, when he plays, he fits in so well, it seems. Uh, yep. Can you tell how frustrated he is? Yeah. Oh, he is, yeah. He's yeah. disappointed. Do you know what causes an enlarged spleen? No. No. Okay. Um, Mark, you expect him to be uh, yes. yeah. percent full usage? Yeah. Uh, he, he was able to eat and keep everything down yesterday. And uh, uh, I talked to him last night, and I talked to him again this morning. Obviously, he's on the ice. He feels good. Have you had the bug, too? No. Knock on wood. 